Hey folks, this is Cracker, three, two, one, boom. Um, if this is your first time to the channel, consider subscribing, hit, uh, leave a like, or leave a comment, it definitely helps this channel. If you've been here before, thanks so much for coming back, make sure you hit the bell icon, select all, so you'll always know when new videos are uploaded. And thanks for subscribing, and make sure you are subscribed. If you think you were a subscriber and you notice you're unsubscribed, just resubscribe. In today's video, I'm going to be reacting to a TikTok user. Uh, he goes by the name of Kali's Life. It's about a one minute video, and basically, it's a short story about a young girl who every day prays to Lucifer. I kid you not. Now, this may be a story. This might be very well true. But I really do enjoy this video. And it's definitely different. So, without further ado... Um, Let's hit play. Oh, and it's titled, The Story of the Little Girl Who Prayed to Lucifer. Play. Have you heard about the little girl who prayed to Lucifer? This happened in Tijuana in 2005. So this little girl would pray okay. for Lucifer every night. She would say prayers for her mom, her dad, and the rest of her family. But at the end of her prayer, she would also include Lucifer. Because she realized that nobody else prayed for him. One day while saying her prayers, her mom overheard her praying for Lucifer. And when her mom confronted her on why she was praying for him, she wouldn't answer. She would just evade the question entirely. One day mysteriously, the little girl passed away. Before I tell you guys the craziest part, this app is paying people just to walk. If you want to check it out, it'll be right here on my page. At her funeral, a guy who was dressed humbly and nice came and paid for everything. The funeral, all of the expenses. But when okay. he signed for everything to be paid for, the only thing he signed with was an L. When the mother confronted him about why he was being so kind, paying for everything, he replied to her with one answer. He said, because she was the only one that prayed for me. Damn. <laughs> okay, the only thing Kali's life said was, this happened in 2005, and it was in Tijuana, Mexico. Now... It happened in Mexico, I can believe, because um, a lot of different things happened in there. So, that's believable. And it happened about 17 years ago. What's really amazing is that, unfortunately, the girl passed. Maybe she was sick, you know. But then, all of a sudden... The person who takes care takes care of everything is the person she was praying to. Now that does sound like that series that's been on TV for a few years now, which I believe is called um, Lucifer, if I'm not mistaken. I used to watch it, but then they took it off, and then I think they put it on a cable service, cable streaming service. But um. It's definitely a unique video. A unique video. Um, it may all be hogwash, but at the same time, can you really say it's completely BS? Because how do we know there are not children or people who do pray to Lucifer? They are. So... When you think about it, you got a young girl doing it. That says a lot. <laughs> it's it's one of those videos where it's like, okay, meh, is it really, did that really happen? But then, well, wait a minute. <laughs> People do do that. The only difference is it's a child and it's a young girl. Well, um, that's it for me. <laughs> um, it is late. Uh, this is Cracker. 
three, two, one, boom. Uh, you can definitely follow me on social media. My tag on Instagram, Ron42513. On Twitter, I can be found under Crow with an E, 11700. You can search me out on Facebook. I'm at Wade2712. And of course, I'm on TikTok, Cracker321. Uh, thanks so much for coming back. Thank you for stopping by. Um, you know what to do. And I will see all of you again real soon. Take care. God bless. Stay safe. Peace.